Happy to be here. Uh, as you said, my name is Rob. Uh, my full name is Robert, which I think is a is a good name because I as I change and grow and evolve, my change my name can change and grow and evolve with me. Like when I was younger, Robbie, more playful, cute, right? Now trying to be cool, Rob. If I want to get responsible, get my act together, Robert. I want to be a bad boy, live life in the fast lane, Bobby. Yeah. Get old, play golf every day, Bob. Get really old, play bridge every day, Bert. Yeah. And if I really want to switch things up, Roberta. A lot of options, one name, so. <laughs> Yes, I'd make a good Roberta, I got it in me. Been playing the Powerball, been losing, that's why I'm here, being judged by strangers. <laughs> it gets up to like hundreds of millions of dollars, like crazy money. I, do you remember when a million dollars used to mean something? That, that used to be a number people would legitimately, back in the day, fantasize about. They'd be like, yo, if I want a million dollars, I go to work on Friday, I'm a millionaire, I'm buying a mansion, I quit, I will never see you again. You win a million dollars today, you go to work on Friday, yo, I'm a millionaire, I'm gonna buy a townhouse. <laughs> in unit, in unit. <laughs> See you Monday, 7 a.m. sharp. <laughs> Life just gets a little bit better, so. Girlfriend and I just uh, moved in together. The move was a, a nightmare, but I realize you can tell where a man is at in his life, whether he will help you move or not, okay? Like, let me explain. You're a young guy, you're in your 20s, your buddy calls you up, dude, I need help moving this weekend. Pizza and beer on me. You know what? Sounds like fun. We'll hang out, we'll list some stuff. I like pizza, I like beer, I got you, I'm there for you, dude. A few years later, you got like a real job, you're making some actual money, get the same phone call, you want me? On my Saturday off to help you move for pizza and beer. Like, I could just buy pizza and beer and not lift a couch. It's hot out. Hire movers. Grow up. You're an adult. A few years later, you got a wife, some kids, same phone call. You want me instead of spending time with my wife and my three kids this weekend to help you move? I am there, dude. Yeah. Pizza and beer on me. I got this. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> we have different views on how to improve the home. She goes, you know what I need? I said, I do, babe. And I'm glad you brought this up. We need a PlayStation 4, right? That's what we need. Uh, she goes, no, we need a hall tree. And I'm like, um, I don't know what a hall tree is. <laughs> but I'm 100% sure we do not need one. So we got a hall tree, brand new, top of the line. Yeah, best they had. Do mm -hmm. you know what a hall tree is? No, you're young, you haven't given up on life yet. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's this piece of furniture when you walk in your house, you sit on it and you take your shoes off and like you hang your keys up and you get up and you go and you don't play on your PlayStation 4, yeah. <laughs> They cost the same, but one is fun and one is a, is a bench, so. <laughs> We're talking about marriage, but then we, we read the reviews and they are mixed. <laughs> yeah, a lot of one-star reviews out there, actually. If, if marriage was on Yelp, it, it would go out of business, I think. <laughs> Everyone knows the stats, 50% of, of all marriages end in divorce, right? And the other 50% of those that, uh, you know, that made it, uh, some of those end in a murder. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> There's an entire TV network dedicated <laughs> to people killing their spouses. Yeah. Do you watch the ID channel? Yeah. You love that, ladies, right. You know what's not on that channel? Reruns. There's no reruns. There's a new murder every single hour, 24-7 murder marathon, no writers. There's a show on there, it's actually called How Not to Kill Your Husband. That's the name. They're like, we know you're gonna try, just don't do what these chicks did. So. Girlfriend's taking notes, it's very meticulous. Right? 
All we watch is the HGTV and then the Murder Channel. It's just Property Brothers, Menendez Brothers, just nonstop. She just... <laughs> She wants us to buy a house, renovate it, flip it, buy a new house, and in that new house, uh, murder me. That's her whole, her whole ten-year plan. So. Local man robs Wendy's with alligator. We're the alligator boys now.